Welcome to Million Moves. In today's tutorial, I will show you all the new Million Moves indicators like Million Moves Oscillators Pro, Smart Money Pro, and I will give you tips how you can get the best out of it. Let's get started. Now we have uh, new indicators. The first one that I will show you is the Smart Money Pro indicator. First go to indicators and you will see it in the invite only scripts tab. Click on Smart Money Pro. This is the new indicator. It will look like this on a chart. You know, before we had order blocks without anything inside. Just the order blocks for support and resistance. Now TradingView allows us to input market activity inside of the order blocks which is very useful and you can see it here in the settings show order blocks on off will show or remove the order blocks and we have it on on of course market volume this is new buy sell activity if you remove it you get the classic look but i would recommend to use it with the market activity activated you can see here we have a green bar which is longer than the red bar. It means that the information here is mostly buy. Therefore, this rectangle is longer. If we go back, you see here below we have a big order block. It means that the short positions, short activity is higher than the long activity. Okay, now let's move on. The second part of the indicator is the market structure and the candlestick coloring of the market structure. What does it mean? These terms are for smart money, boss and coach. Coach means change of character and boss means break of structure. Basically, you have a lower low, higher high, higher high and lower low. It is complicated stuff. Then we have the million moves algo for this with the dot system which helps you with the lower low and higher high. This is the dot system and you can see here, as soon as we break the previous low movement here, it becomes a change of character, which means the chart is now bullish. I removed the Belimus algo now. Now we have a red change of character. It means the up movement is broken exactly here. Now the price is more in a sell movement. If we get a second break of structure, which is also red, the candlestick coloring becomes more red. You see, this is a dark red and a second confirmation makes the candlestick coloring more bright. Now, this line here is for me. I draw this line. You can do it too, because you see, we have two points. You just connect the two points here and that's your trend line. And you can see here, we have a breakout, then a retest, and then we have a change of character, which is bullish, it's green. And then we get a order block, which is green, which means support. So price jumped from here. We have a bullish change of character. And now we have a second bullish market structure break, which is called boss. And now we have bright candles and price just pumps. That's how it works. One change of character confirmed. This is our second one. And you can see how much price moves until it touches the big order block with 40%. This number here is the activity inside. Okay. The market activity inside. This 5% is a small order block. Means, for example, right now, what can happen? Bitcoin can jump up and retest this area. Or it can drop down, do a small up movement and then go down to the big order block with 40%. If Bitcoin should go to this order block, then we are in trouble because it will move further. This is how we can use the new Smart Money Pro indicator of million moves you can read the market. It's amazing. You can use it on the one hour, 50 minutes, 30 minutes, 10 minutes. It doesn't matter. But I use it on the one hour and 30 minutes just for my confirmation 
of everything that I use. The second new indicator is, if you click on indicators, you might see that we don't have the clean scalper here anymore. We don't have the real one TSI anymore inside. Why? It's now in the Oscillators Pro. Everything is combined in one indicator to save space, which makes sense. So add the Oscillators Pro to your chart and you will see the clean scalper, which is our classic milli moves indicator. You can then switch here, select mode in the settings. You can switch to the real one TSI, which allows you to manually find divergences. Okay, this is the classic real one TSI indicator. And now you can select the Peak Spotter Plus. Okay, Peak Spotter Plus. This indicator of Millie Moves is amazing. And I show you why. If you have anything on your chart from Millie Moves, then you want to make sure that you add the Peak Spotter to your chart too. Check this out. We have a green dot and a red dot. The red dot means we are an overbought area. The green dot means we are an oversold area. It might be confusing for you. Just remember red for short, green for buy. Okay? Now you see we have this sell momentum. What we want to do is if we have a movement like this, you want to watch for the red dots. Every red dot is an entry opportunity. You can see here 6.4 red dot red dot what do we have here boom 10 percent now price becomes bullish you see price becomes bullish and we want to see for an overreaction you see we have here one and this gives you straight 2.4 percent it's not always a guarantee but if you want to trade and want to take a setup have a look on the peak spotter plus because it will help you Let's say you want to go, you don't have the Smart Money Pro on your chart, okay? You see, wow, this looks so bullish. I want to go into this trade. But then you look on the Oscillators Pro peak spotter here at the bottom and you will see we have a red dot. Now you should think twice. If you have a red dot, hmm, should I take a buy signal? Probably not. Better wait for a green dot. But you will see we are already in a downtrend. If I just activate the Millimoose algo, yes, you will see we have a buy signal. As we get the green dot, okay, price should move up, but it doesn't. Okay, the trend ribbon is red. We are below the moving average and we get a sell signal. Take it always as a measurement for your trades. For example, here, okay, we have a bullish trend and every green dot is an entry. You see, the best ones are the ones outside of these lines. So you see this green dot. Let's check the entry 5.9. Again, a green dot. It's already bearish. Okay. Now see here we have the green dot. Still you have 2.30%. This is how you can use the Oscillators Pro. You can use it also on gold. Check the gold chart. You can use the Millimoose Algo. You can check your buy signal. And... For example, here you see we have a green dot and then a smart plus buy signal and the price rockets. Then again, we have a sell signal shortly after the red dot. Boom, price goes down. Now here we have a green dot. However, the buy signal is very delayed, so it would be too late. Okay, this is how we can use it and it doesn't matter which chart. Let's check the German, German DAX. Here I'm on the five minute chart, okay? And you can see here, first the change of character, break of structure, and now we want to wait for a green dot. Where is the green dot? Now we have here a green dot, boom, immediately 200 points on the DAX. A green dot, check this out, boom, 160 points. A green dot, check this out, boom, until it becomes overbought, okay? 380, and it doesn't matter which chart, Check this out. US 100. Let's jump to the one minute chart. I'm here at the US 100. And you can see amazing how the order block system of the Smart Money Pro works. Touch, touch, boom. And every time you can check the Oscillators Pro. Look, what a beautiful entry. You can see here, we have a green dot. We have a touch into the order block. 
and from there boom it goes straight up skyrocket second one touch green dot and then skyrocket if you want to trade from now on always check the peak spotter pro have a look on the hourly or 30 minute chart to the smart money pro indicator so you have an idea what's going on here i can see you see how the hourly chart went up into the order block and immediately rejected this is how you can use it so the next area of interest is in this case this number what you can do is take this rectangle tool and draw this rectangle here the same so if you change on a lower time frame you have always these areas okay and from there you can work again you can activate the millimus algo we have a sell signal why does it work because we have a big order block rejection boom here's the entry boom here's the exit price becomes overbought so if you miss the move here and you see the green dot here below you don't want to go into a short position this is the beautiful thing about the peak spotter always if you want to take a short you want to look for a red dot if you want to take a buy you want to look for a green dot you see here green dot green dot buy price goes up my recommendation is you have at least the peak spotter on your chart and then from there you can combine it you have to sit and think which method is the best to make money every method with million moves indicators makes you money but you have to find your favorite <laughs> okay just don't throw everything on your chart make sure you have a good combination use the smart money pro for a higher time frame analysis use the million moves algo for the buy sell signals or just use the range maniac with the gu down gu up signals and combine it always with our new peak spotter plus indicator it will help you amazingly if you have any questions write a comment below see you soon